An estuary is a partially enclosed body of water where fresh water from rivers and streams mixes with salt water from the ocean. Estuaries are often found where rivers meet the sea and are characterized by their unique mix of fresh water and salt water. They are areas of transition between the land and the sea and are home to a diverse array of plant and animal life. Estuaries are important habitats for many species of fish, birds, and other wildlife, and they also provide valuable resources for human use, such as seafood, timber, and recreation. Estuaries are often referred to as nurseries of the sea because they provide a safe and sheltered environment for many species of fish and other marine life to grow and reproduce. Good morning, good morning, good morning. Yes, it's Beatrice Vivius, Frankie T. Sox and Pardet with your very, very early morning beach. Beautiful sunrise coming today. Come par dit. Ook kan je niet zien. Was jij? Let's just listen. Enjoy all this prettiness. All, all this sensory candy this early in the morning. What can I say? Look at the pretty sunrise. It's beautiful. Just that cloud bank over the ocean. Otherwise the sky is clear. North easterly winds so far. As the sun rises over the Indian Ocean, the skies above the St. Lucia estuary are painted with a palette of vibrant colors. Deep reds and oranges blend into soft pinks and purples, creating a truly breathtaking sight. The gentle sound of waves crashing against the sandy beaches adds to the peaceful atmosphere as the cool sea breeze brushes against your skin. As the sun crests the horizon, it casts a warm glow over the landscape, highlighting the lush greenery and sparkling waters of the estuary. The birds begin to sing, filling the air with their melodies as they take to the skies, soaring above the treetops. This is a moment of pure beauty and serenity, a moment to be savored and treasured. As you stand there, gazing out at the stunning vista before you, you can't help but feel grateful for this incredible moment of peace and wonder. The beautiful sunrise over the Indian Ocean at St. Lucia Estuary is a sight that you will never forget. Oh, she loves the mornings on the beach. I can't help Wiseman moving tractors and buckies today. Because Pardet is with me, but Wiseman understands that. It remains beautiful, doesn't matter how ugly the sandbanks form, how difficult the launches are, the water color, it just doesn't matter. It remains beautiful. Sandbank formation to the north quite hectic so it's low tide uh, with these colors you can call it high tide fishing beaches now with the clean water going to come in today with the rising tide this might be a good fishing spot north or south of Ingwe north of the east Premier. This is the second bath, the first one. 
or whatever you want to call it it's the northern map the northern challenge channel we're gonna have a look now I think it pretty much closed up a lot there at the southern channel now look at that peninsula finger crying in across oh. let's get some height over there on that beam over there and we see where our, the footage look like from up there Let's I'm not on top of the dune yet as you guys can see I still don't want to do the shot of this beautiful bird life yeah I'm not even gonna try and name the birds I know the big ones is yellow belt stalk that's quite easy wow a mud bank on the opposite sandbank where there wasn't there was ocean a couple of weeks ago We're in a strand lipperki. Yellow bolt stalk. Sitting there in the basking in the sun of the great hunt early this morning. Yeah, the clay layer that forms the whole basin of the whole base of the Sandian range that was built here about in 2017 by the K5 project. So I call them the Gift 5 Foundation. Okay, now we've got a nice view of what's happening there at the southern mouth. Look at that. Well, no, she's not out of the woods yet. Daddy can still go and work on the tractor. And she's calling me home. Come daddy, come daddy, let's go home. <laughs> but did we can't film wise man help us act need in yeah? So pretty. Then keep so. on finding the interesting things here. This is the indigenous dragon tree flower. Oh, how pretty is that? How this crazy where they say weedy wheel. Absolutely stunning. Right here at the entrance to the boardwalk, there's another dragon tree that's in flower. And this one is standing up straight, you can see where the shaft of the flower stem goes out of the dragon tree there's quite a few dragon trees here at the entrance to the boardwalk they line the vegetation nicely to the left and the right 